Okay. All right, Kurt, you're going to start off? Who's we'll starting off? Yes. Tell us what's happening here today. Minister. Okay, basically, um, uh, we've been hearing the outcry, especially for the, the, the residents of Weymouth Hill, for some years now. And um, we have sat with uh, different stakeholders, uh, Bali Estate, uh, Prima Vista, and uh, we came to an agreement to do a, a public-private partnership between government and the different stakeholders, where together we will pave the first phase of the, the so-called Link 6, that's basically the Weymouth Hill uh, section of, of this area. And um, that is the, the partnership between government and the stakeholders. And, and this is something we are very proud of because they see the need to uh, contribute to the development of the area. And government, which is uh, have uh, certain uh, strains with the budget and so forth, uh, looking at possibilities to partner with other stakeholders to improve the infrastructure of the island and this is one such way and uh, we want to thank uh, uh, Valley Estate, we want to thank uh, Prima Vista for partnering with government and uh, uh, executing this very important uh, project for the, the, the community of Raymond Hill. What's the timeline on the project? Well the timeline I'll leave it over for, for the experts to indicate. Well, we plan was to start within this in a few weeks. Eh? So, yeah. uh, by the end of the month, uh, early October, we should be uh, we should be started. Okay, uh, but Minister, you said first phase. So, can we expect? Well, um, what is happening? We awarded a few months ago uh, the, the contract for the design of the Link Six, and it's two sections: is this section, and then you have, of course, the Bethlehem section. So we have um, the design phase, but this is just an interim solution where. The paving of this road will be used as the foundation for the future um, Link 6 road. But um, before the design phase and everything is finalized, we could be a year further or whatever. So in the interim, um, this is a, a, the first phase. A, a first phase, a solution to, to relieve the situation. Because with the heavy rainfall and thing, the money we just spend excavating the road, fixing the road and thing is best we um, you know, Period. put the money to, to go to use. We would like to thank, of course, government and our other partners here at Valley Estate because um, I am also a person, I live up here, I live in Prima Vista State, and um, we've had some issues besides the road, you know, thefts and everything, and by doing this, we add value to our community, yeah. and this can help the police force, ambulance, fire department, everybody gets to our houses in a quicker time than how it was before. Yeah. So on behalf of Prima Vista, I would like to say thank you. The Women Hill Association? Oh, okay, we are. Ready? You want to say something? Um, oh, yes, go ahead. As a representative of the people of St. Martin, and especially listening to the cries of the community, and looking at, you have a very good community police officer too, look, looking at the safety aspect of all residents in the area. Not only from the fire department, you're looking at the ambulance and all of those different areas. And the first thing they always said, they need a, a good road for them to, to get to the, to the residents. And this is a, a project which started way back as the former minister of Romy, which he listened to the cries of the community that came. The first meeting in my office was like, you know, at that time, minister, we need to upgrade the road here, Raymond Hill. And I'll be honest with you, and thanks for the minister listening now to the people, and especially creating an opportunity where you have all stakeholders, thanks to ICE, you have the, the Carty's family, but don't forget also you have the Hodge and also the, the Gibbs family, because at the, at the entrance, they're the ones also, they have to be part of it. So you can see it's a whole community effort where we're looking at the general interest of the community. And, you know, this is not something happened, like I say, you know, it's because of, of, of politics, but it's something for the, for the people of, of uh, Weymouth Hill and the residents of, um, let's say, from South War to St. Peter's and all of that. So, you know, this is a big day, and I have to say, on behalf of the people, uh, as a representative, it's good to see that the minister really put this into action. I thank you.